I feel really far away from you right now because I don't have the wide angle anymore and I'm really sad, but that's okay. But now I'm with the 55 to 250 and that's a big zoomer comparatively and, and I'm, I'm like that far away from you. But hi, happy Tuesday. Today I'm going to show y'all what I did to that photo and how I did it on my phone. What photo you're talking about? You know, the one on for my Project 52 for Orange where I had the uh, mostly black and white photo and I brought out the orange and the green little bunny. Snapseed is a free app that is usable on both iOS and Android. It was probably one of my first apps and I've loved it and it's super easy. It's free. So when you open up Snapseed, you can use your camera or open your latest image or open from your device. I just open from my device and I pick the photo I want to use and it's that photo that I had there at fully color. Little pin. Open that. Has your basics. Tune, details, rotate, brush, healing, text, vignette, transform, crop. I've never used the text. Oh. You learn something new every day. We're not going to do that today. We're going to do something else. What I did was I started with the HDR escape because I want, knew I wanted to really kind of pop the colors a bit and HDR does that. And I went to, there's a nature, there's a people, there's a whatever. And with that, I chose people, but I don't want to be limited to their auto. So what you can do is you can take your little finger there and start moving left and right. And you'll see some changes. And it'll go from a zero where it's not very HDR all the way to 100 where it's like super HDR on that filter string. I wanted right there, about that 50. Click on the check, boom, done. And I click on that again for my second one and I wanted black and white. And with black and white, you have a bunch of different filters. I think I chose bright. But then I also chose, along with filters, you can choose like some different color filters go over it and I'll do some screenshots on that also. I chose, I think the red, no. It was the green. And I'll show you some screenshots on that too as we're going through just because of how it makes the black and white look based on the color that it's pulling. Check mark that and you're like, okay, well it's black and white. Well, how'd you get the color to pull through, right? What Snapseed has is it has your layers of what you've done and what you've edited so far. And right now I've done two. I've done HDR and I've done black and white. So I click on that and it shows you original, HDR, black and white. And that's your top layer because that's your most recent. You click on that, it has a trash can so you can delete it, it has a brush so you can brush over it and paint, and then it has your little scroll bar so you can edit it some more. I'm going to click on the paint one. Oh, it's back to color. So now I get to paint on where I want the black and white. And it's at 100%, so that means opacity wise it's going to be completely black and white of what I just did in my previous edit. Now, with this fat finger, you it would be really shoddy work if I keep it here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to zoom in and get as much work as I can by zooming in as close as I can to get as detailed as I can. And I can go wherever I want on this picture, get some black and whites on here, put, paint the black and white on here, and basically do whatever I want. Now the next thing I want to do is the second trick. I have on here at the top you're going to see, and I'll screenshot this too and show this as an image, there's this little ornament. I don't really want that there. It, it's just personally not what I want there. I'm going to click on the healing brush. It's a little band-aid. I'm going to zoom in again because I want to be precise. And I'm going to have my little screenshots here again. Take my trusty finger and I'm going to paint over that too. And you'll see that it's red, and when I let go, it's gonna go away. Now it looks like it's messed up, so then I can just paint over again how I need to. Pretty cool, huh? And then you can click that check mark, and once you do that, the picture you want. Snapseed, one of my favorite tools on the phone, free, try it out, or not. Have a great night, SSS Veda, day 16, see you tomorrow.